Oh, ready for those? Welcome in. It is time to check out this week's weekly challenge. Speed demons. There must be something in the air. Everyone's going crazy. Crickle fan go type in Maple Lodge campsite. Oh, boy. Does that mean we're, we're all fast? So, like, we're fast? Also, the ghost is fast? Hmm. Okay. 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 Yo, I'm going to be honest, too. Uh, with all the hype about Point Hope last week, I completely forgot to do the weekly. I realized yesterday, I was like, oh, shoot, I didn't make a weekly video. But it's, you know what? I don't even know what the weekly was. <laughs> I don't know, but I apologize. But we're here on this weekly. Uh, we have Unbreaker. It's right there. We have no setup timer. We do have 100% sanity. Um, are we fast? Let's hope, yeah, we feel pretty fast. Lots of sprints. Lots of sprints. Okay, um, mostly tier 2 equipment, yeah? Is that the flashlight? Dude. Oh my god, it makes- I haven't used a tier 1 since they changed it, like the sound. Okay, why do they have to do this? They give us like mostly tier 2, all oh, the tier 1 candles. But then like the tier 1 headcam, like could you at least give us a flashlight? Hello? Okay, so I think we do flashlight, thermo to find the ghosty, EMF, um, and then, uh, we. I hate it here. What do you mean? <laughs> There's no patches. For... I think I rem do I remember this challenge. I don't know. They all run together. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. This is a okay. There's no, there's no igniters. So, um, yeah, that's fun. Okay, well, we're gonna go inside. We're gonna get the breaker on. Um, we're gonna find the ghost, hopefully, potentially. Now, I know people have been telling me that they patched the picnic tables on Camp Woodwind. So you can't, like, infinitely loop them. I don't know if they've also done that on Maple Lodge. I would assume so. They've done it on Camp Woodwind. They also want to fix one on Maple Lodge, so. It's going to be fun looping the ghosts. That's kind of been my crutch, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> but we can still make it work. We can still make it work. All right. I'm going to look for the ghosts. I'm basically just going to walk around. Look for an area. Hello. That is cold um everywhere is kind of 10 degrees which is a little awkward so we're looking for an area that's probably like five or below might take me a while ghost might hunt before then i'll bring you all back if anything exciting happens i should probably also be looking for the curse item i'll start doing that too it did get down to like 7.8 like here seven so are you like in here Okay, well, this, this can't be a ghost room right here. I don't think so. Kind of looks like it might be. Maybe? You're like in here? No. Well, <laughs> outdoor maps are so weird. Oh, here we go. Okay. This looks promising. No? Okay, I think the ghost is like here ish. Yeah. So you're like a outside. Well, okay, so outdoor mums are weird because, like, outside is going to be generally cold. Colder than, like, in here. Um, so it can be a little awkward. We're just going to sit up right here. I mean, it's, like, five degrees? Six? Ish? Maybe? I'm going to sit up here and hope for the best. Okay, we have activity going on somewhere. I didn't hear anything where I set up. So, I mean, I guess it could have been while I was walking out, though. Maybe. Possibly. I did get stuck in the cabin. Um, I, I have adaptive lighting turned off, which maybe for this game I turn it on. Because on uh, Point Hope, when you go to the very top, if you try to loop the ghosts with eye adaptation on, the light from the, the light bulb, giant light bulb, like, makes it really dark. So I turn it off and I'm going to loop the ghosts up there. Okay, please tell me you're over here. Or was I silly? Kinda feeling a little silly right now. Also, I'm really dropping frames. What the heck? Hello, frames. Come back to me. Where are you? How old are you? Huh. Awkward. It's gonna be a cabin ghost, right? Oh, I found a spine. I might do a little more exploration. Just to be sure. Maybe I haven't checked over by the cabin. I was feeling pretty co- I heard that. That was over there. Okay. <laughs> we were close. Wait, I have the EMF on. I heard it like throw a, a fork. Here? Aha! Okay, I was close. Alright. 
Can we get one more light on? I think it should be right here. Okay. So we're shooting for yellow tents. I haven't seen a cursed item yet, but I've only looked for Ouija board and music box. And I forgot to drop my flashlight. Oh no, the, yeah, okay. That Imasu, I really need to get the UV and check that for fingerprints. Oh, I didn't bring one, right? Because I brought a, the other flashlight instead. Oops. Uh, it's so bright. I can't see. Oh, there's an orb. I saw that. I saw you. Come back. Baby, come back. Yeah, okay, you're in there. All right. Orbs. Okay. Um, how are the temps looking? Cold. Oh, okay. You are cold. Okay. Indubitably, yes. Okay, so... Revenant, Eerie, Haunt you, Unreal, and of course, potentially Mimic as well. We gotta look for all the evidence for Mimic. So we just need to see... I don't know how much evidence there is. I'm assuming all three right now. So we just gotta check to make sure... And see if there's Spear Box and UV. So Mimic will have four evidence. Okay. Boom, boom. And I think that's all the evidence stuff. Just get Jesus for safety. Sandy is chilling. Okay. Now, I also kind of been glancing around. I haven't seen hiding yet. I haven't really looked. So, oh, okay. We do have UV. So it's either a Hauntu or a Mimic. Where are you? How old are you? Are you friendly? Where are you? How old are you? Are you friendly? Uh, <laughs> so you see, we have this. We've definitely found all four pieces of evidence, but it says no ghost. That's because a mimic has all this evidence, but orbs don't actually count. Um, they're forced, but they aren't actually listed as a piece of evidence. So, mimic. All right, well, we do have all three, well, technically four pieces of evidence in this game, but all three pieces of evidence. Okay, that's actually huge. In <laughs> some games, I don't find all three, and I, I can't tell you all if there's actually a piece of evidence. So we did it, yeah? Okay, um, I'm not going to get the ghost to hunt this time. But we'll probably get them the hunt by the end, just so we can see how fast the ghost is. Just for, just for science. Nice, Welcome a nice back. little Mimo for our first game. Love it. Thankfully, it wasn't like a, a demon. <laughs> I was first walking around trying to figure out what I was doing. Okay, does that count? Yes. All right, two more games. Let's do it. What do y'all think about the thermo, um, like the tier two and tier three thermo changes? I haven't used tier one since the update, so I don't know how it is. Um, we do have Sunday Man. I like the fact that it actively updates. However, my finger gets tired of holding down right click. <laughs> I, I wish it wasn't, we didn't have to press and hold it. Wish it was like the OG thermo. But I understand, I understand. It's just, it is aggressively loud in here when it's raining. Holy, okay. Bear is in the area, by the way. I should probably be checking each individual tent, but um, that sounds like a tomorrow problem. <laughs> we'll, we'll come back if I can't find it. Take all the tents. My favorite part of all Maple Lodge. I don't know. I, I think it's all the satisfying. Use that. I don't know why. Don't you dare be in the cabin. Don't you do it. I forbid it. I'm. There's like a 25% chance I just heard a door touch in the cabin. Okay, no, I think we unless it's upstairs, I think we're good. Don't you dare be up here. I think we're in the clear? It's pretty warm. Yeah. Oh, just kidding. Uh, <laughs> oh, so I, I, yo, I heard that door touch from all the way outside. Oh, did it just throw that shoe? Okay, um, well, we got a cabin ghost. Wonderful. Okay, we have returned with the video camera. Do you have... Oh. Dude, that like sounds so loud. It sounds like it's gonna be EMF5. Uh, I'm not seeing ghosty grapes. Nashtavashniki. Also, my flash... Oh, that's gotta be EMF5, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> that's like aggressively loud, holy. Okay, so if you move five, check. Oh my God, it's so loud. So probably no shade though, because it did that while we were in the room. Probably, I don't know. I've had a 
A few people tell me that shade still is like kind of buggy that they've gotten writing um, while they're in the room with the shade or they've blown out a candle. So, so spirit box, UV, and let's do salt because Wraith is an option. Sanity check. Decent. I mean, this ghost is wild in there. Look at that. Look at that email for it. Maybe just like one sanity pill just to be safe. Because like it could be a gin. And so if we go back and get zapped by there's a sanity get zapped, we're in the danger zone. So. Okay, going back. Okay, I have returned. No writing. Mm, oh, we do have UV. This means I have to check for Gorio though. Um, I don't really need the salt, so I'll just kind of, I don't know. <laughs> we cross off race with UV. Okay, so we're looking for freezing, writing, I'm pretty sure, right? And then dots and orbs. We already didn't see orbs. Maybe I double check. You know, I almost just picked up the telescope, trying to look for orbs. No orbs can be a little sneaky. No, okay, there's like a shimmer on that that painting, that photo. That makes me think it's an orb. I'm not seeing orbs unless they're like on downstairs. Let's just like check for freezing. Wait, what? It's, it's so toasty. Why is it so toasty? Hello? Oh. Okay. Um, okay. That that works. You're in here. Okay. My, my apologies for, um... Oh. You, I didn't even hear that door touch. I did not. I did not even hear that door touch. That's crazy. Okay. Again. Easy peasy. Yeah, this challenge should be pretty straightforward. Just go in, find your evidence. Take sanity pills if you need to, keep your sanity up. I've had a pretty decent time looking for the ghost. Uh, Thermo's been pretty good for just kind of locating the coldest area. Listen for any interactions, you know, and it grows. Okay. We've done it. You know, it's funny, I said it could be a gin zap my sanity. It didn't zap my sanity. My sanity's still pretty much chilling. But it could have. Very well could have. Okay. Ta -da. Uh, one more game. Also, if you're wondering what this um, player card is, I, I meant to mention this earlier. This is for getting 50 ghosts correct on Point Hope. I think it looks incredible. <laughs> it's the, the attention to detail. Their artists are absolutely insane. Okay. Um, Maple Lodge, double check. Counted. Perfect. Here we go. Yay, we got sunrise weather. Let's go. Oh, my game's also dying. Come back. Here we go. <laughs> All right. Oh, breaker though. Breaker's the bathrooms again. Okay. I keep forgetting to check to see if there's a cursed item. We don't like really need a cursed item for this challenge. I mean, it would be nice um, if you need to like find the ghost. I guess I've not been looking for that. So we just kind of I've been finding the ghost and getting my three evidence. It's been pretty. Bada bing, bada boom. I will look around though. So I didn't see Voodoo doll. Not see Ouija board. No music box. I think this mirror is probably in here. I'm such a noob when it comes to Maple Lodge curse items. Maybe yeah. Okay, uh, I know Monkey Paw spawns over here. Okay, we have monkey paw. All right, there is a cursed item. I don't know, don't know what it was the first couple games, because I didn't check. But <laughs> this time it's monkey paw, which could be good if you need to change the weather. But otherwise, I don't really like using the monkey paw. Although they did change the wish to see the ghost wish, right? So that you're not blinded until after the ghost event. But still, let me in. Are you gonna be in here again? Twenty degrees. It's pretty, pretty warm. I'm gonna say no. The cabin. And there I go. See you, Sophie. Where do you reside? 
Are we at the point where we check each individual tent? We might be. This might be. Alright, tent number one. Nada. Tent number two. Nada. Three. Oh. No. Three. Wait, I heard that. That wasn't me. Or did, did it do that weird bug where if you interact with a tent door, it like interacts with another one? I swear I just heard a separate, separate tent door. Oh. Okay. Alright, ma'am. Ma'am, you're, you're inside the tent? Ma'am, that's not how tents work? I keep thinking I'm my UV. I'm so Okay, you're definitely touching that. I'm so used to having like UV, thermo, EMF, and like using night vision goggles. So that was, um, I don't have a UV. I'm gonna take one sanity. I don't really need to, we're at 84, but just in case. Um, I can go back with UV. With the UV, your box. Oh, okay. So the fingerprints on these little tents will be like right here. I don't see any. So be in a box, eh? Copium. Are you even here? Or was that just like a glitch in the matrix? It's 12 degrees. Mm. Not convinced. More. Oh, wait, 10 degrees. Where are you? Okay, 9.8, so maybe in here? Let me still check the blue tent real quick. Or black tent, I don't know. <laughs> Colors are weird. Okay, I'm gonna start here. Okay. Where are you? From behind. Oh, okay. <laughs> you are there, perfect, okay. So, boom. What's that noise? No. Dude, that air ball is arriving from Narnia. You're not gonna- No, I don't want it. I don't want it! Thank you. Okay. So, okay. Spear box. Check. Oh, okay. Writing. Check. Holy, you just really... Could we- No, any- Okay, this tent door is just not- Not having it. Um... Okay, so we need to look for a lot of stuff. Freezing. There's no UV, right? I'm gonna double check UV. Uh, dots. Orbs. Maybe who would have orbs? Mare, right? Yeah, okay. I think Pulti would have UV, and then Spirit would have EMF5. Okay. Basically, I gotta look for all the things. Uh, we could potentially be cursed by Maroi, so I'll try to take note of my sanity. It's like 90 90-ish. Um... It's also kind of difficult because you gotta like really stay in the light, right? To not lower your sanity. Number three. It's also super bright and this door is just doing its own thing. Uh, I'm not seeing any orbs in here. Put dots down in case you just want to be a Dio. That'd be cool. Oh, okay. Hello. Um. You want to set to the dots while you're doing that? No. Okay, 4.7. Try to throw over here, I thought. Maybe, possibly. No? Okay. <laughs> I heard a throw. Okay. Oh, I think it was a shoe. Okay. Number three. Alright, let's get like... Crucifix, we'll check our sanity. I might grab a candle. We can kind of try to maybe keep eye on sanity that way. It's freezing. It, Maroi would have freezing. Uh, that might take a little bit. So we could use the power of no evidence testing to see. I mean, I see how these dropped like a little bit, but we might have been in the dark. So let's grab a candle. Oh, just kidding. I forgot. Y'all probably laughing at me. I forgot we don't matches. We will not acquire a candle. We will continue to fight for our life without fire. <laughs> 
<laughs> Anything else will help me test for? Um, I mean, we could look for... Oh gosh, dots really quick. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Um. Uh, I think I'd rather look for dots in person. So I mean, my sanity did drop a little bit. I don't know how much my sanity is draining by just standing out in the open, like underneath that one light. Like, is this enough light right here to keep my sanity from draining? I would think so. We could even try to turn that light on. Okay. I right, ghosty. What are you? I don't think Pulte, because we haven't I haven't seen any UV. However, I can't really close this door to properly check. It's being really weird. And however, check this door that it touched over here. No, you this door? Okay. Okay, so no UV. Cross off poltergeist. I don't really want that to hit me because I'm trying to test for Moray with my sanity right now. Okay. I guess you're confused as to what I mean by like being cursed by Moray. Um, Moray has an ability where if you get a spear box or a paramic response, the Moray will then curse you, which doubles your passive sanity drain, even if you're in the light or even if you were to hold a candle. So I'm trying to see if, despite me being in the light, if my sanity is still draining, uh, which could mean it's a Moray. And if you want to get rid of that curse, which actually... Did I take sanity pills? Let me just get one more spear box. That does? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm all over the place. Let me get one more spear box response just in case. Where are you? How old are you? Yeah, young, uh, okay. Because I, I know I took sanity pills. I can't remember if they're before or after. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, I got the, the, the spear box response. Okay. No freezing yet. Oh, okay. So that, it's a deal! Okay. Okay. Well, that makes sense. Alright. Well, we can definitely get this ghost to hunt. See what the speed sounds like. Um, probably wish to trap them. Also kind of see how this picnic table works. I'm going to grab the paramic just in case we want to hear the speed before she gets over here. Why? These doors never open the way I think they're going to. I wish to trap the ghost. Oh, look, a spine. Okay, now I have 60 seconds until she hunts. Oh, okay. Well, I turn on the paramount just to see, you know, maybe what's going on over there, and this is what I hear. <laughs> awesome. Okay. Oh, she turned it off. Thank you. Oh, phone call. Here we go. Okay, yeah, the ghost is insanely fast. Oh my god. Okay, I don't know if it's like a Dio thing or what, but they're still getting confused with this picnic table. Is it just because she's a Dio? She doesn't know the fastest way to pass to me? Oh my god. It's like she figured it out for a second, and then was like, eh. I don't know. It, it might be completely different against a normal speed of ghosts. Uh, okay, well, we've done it. We have done it. Ta da! Well, there is a weekly challenge for you. Honestly, pretty straightforward. The only scary part is the ghost is really fast, but. You can, I mean, as, as you saw, I got all the evidence before the ghost even hunted. Also, finding the ghost might be difficult, but like I mentioned earlier, just walk around the thermal, listen to see if the ghost has any throws. Because uh, that was honestly a lot of the way that I pinpointed where the ghost was. Is like they like threw something or touched something. Uh, but yeah, let me know, as always, in the comments, how the challenge went for you. But that is all I have for you on this video. I hope you did enjoy. 
If you did, make sure to drop the video a like. If you're new here, drop the channel a sub. Otherwise, good luck, ghost hunting, and I will see you in the next one.